Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today I'm gonna to be sharing a quick mantle decor compilation video of six ways I have decorated my fireplace mantle for the winter season. And some of the decorating is using nature or using neutral pieces. And some were for particular seasons where I just removed a few items to change it from season or holiday specific to general decorating. And since we're approaching February, I figured I'd start with a Valentine themed mantle update date from 2020. I hope you like these and if you stay tuned to the end I have a quick little recap of some of my really old mantle decorating ideas. So for all the full videos they will be in the description box and I hope you like them. I was looking online and I found a heart tree and I thought it would be nice to replicate this on my mantle. So I found a swirly tree, I downloaded the picture and then I put the image on my computer and then I happen to have a projector. I use this to project the image onto the wall and then just trace it out and then I'll have the tree up on the mantle and then I can decorate it to my liking. And then I found these wooden hearts at the Dollar Tree. So I got four packs of them, but I only ended up using three. And I wanted everything to be red, so I just painted over the pink and the cream hearts with the red paint. For January, I just leave up a plain winter look. And then for February, I always decorate with some kind of hearts or something. And the mantle is where I start. So this is something that I'm putting together, textured wall art for the month of February, but it is in line with Valentine's Day. This is a wall art piece. I got inspired by a picture that I saw and I'll insert that right here so you can see what I had to work with as my inspiration. So I used five foam boards that I purchased from the Dollar Tree. Also, I made a frame around this using two pieces of thin wood that you can find at Home Depot.
So I'm using a branch from an evergreen tree as well as this frame that I purchased at the Goodwill a really long time ago. that I gathered around my yard and I'm going to use these sticks to create letters to spell out the words Merry Christmas and I'm going to cut them down in well I'm just going to snap them actually I'm not even going to cut them but I'm just going to snap them to the sizes that I need Thank you. 